It shouldn't come as a surprise that Global Guardian, a mass Armageddon drill, was in full swing. The drill would pose all sorts of threats and even mobilize command centers known as doomsday planes that house top military personnel. Although originally scheduled for late October, it was moved up unexpectedly. One of these doomsday planes was on the scene of the Pentagon strike. Now to one of the eeriest moments amid the carnage of 9-11, a mysterious plane was seen flying right over the president's residence. Even some CNN staffers saw it. To this day, it has never been officially explained. Tonight, Chief National Correspondent John King has new details about this great 9-11 mystery. Today, six years after 9-11, the mystery endures about just what happened in the skies over the White House that terrible day. A plane flew right over it. But why? And what was it? It appeared overhead just before 10 a.m., a four-engine jet banking slowly in the nation's most off-limits airspace. About 10 minutes ago, there was a white jet circling overhead. Now, you generally don't see planes in the area over the White House. That is restricted airspace. Two government sources familiar with the incident tell CNN it was a military aircraft. They say the details are classified. This comparison of the CNN video and an official Air Force photo suggests the mystery plane is among the military's most sensitive aircraft, an Air Force E-4B. Note the flag on the tail, the stripe around the fuselage, and the telltale bubble just behind the 747 cockpit area. The E-4B is a state-of-the-art flying command post, built and equipped for one reason, to keep the government running no matter what, even in the event of a nuclear war. The reason it was nicknamed the Doomsday Plane during the Cold War. They exercise uh, this type of thing all of the time, and they simply don't talk about it. Uh, so it doesn't surprise me that they, uh, that they are very closed-mouthed about it. Ask the Pentagon, and it insists this is not a military aircraft. And there is no mention of it in the official report of the 9-11 Commission. But six years later, the Pentagon, the Secret Service, and the FAA all say they, at least for public consumption, have no explanation of the giant plane over the president's house, just as the smoke began to rise across the river at the Pentagon. There is also footage of another white mystery plane in the restricted airspace over New York City before the second attack. And as the second plane strikes the World Trade Center.